Oh, you're just gonna pretend you didn't happen? Oh, wow, okay. So, you just, you're honestly just gonna pretend it didn't happen? Ronnie, you saying something? Oh my god. <laughs> What's going on, mate? What do you mean? This. Ah, uh, just w working. What is going on with your attitude at the moment? I literally have no idea what you're talking about. Um, you don't want to address what's just happened? What happened? Destruction of company property. You, are you talking about just when I dropped this pen? Yeah, I'm talking about the pen, Alan, and the disrespect. I feel like you might be overreacting a little overreacting bit. Overreacting a little bit? Oh, are you talking about, uh, so it's fine to just kind of drop company property, nearly destroy it, and then very suspiciously and very sneakily just look all around you, kneel down and go like this. Pick up the pen and go, oh, thinking, oh, I hope no one saw what I was up to. <laughs> As you go back to your desk and then try and get on with your work, having basically destroyed company property. You think that's fine? Ron, I, I might just get back to work. No, 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 you're not gonna get back to work. I'm trying to teach you a lesson here. You can't just drop things and not take responsibility, mate. Okay. I'm, I'm, I am just going to get back to work. No, 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 you're not going to just get back to work. You're going to address the situation. You can't just keep ignoring problems when they come up. You're breaking pens. What else are you breaking? How, how do I, how, what else are you breaking? Nothing. Nothing? Like, yeah. you'd like you didn't drop the pen? Well, uh, yeah, I admit I dropped the pen, but I didn't All right, break. just to clarify the logic here, you're saying, you're saying it'll be fine for me to just, I don't know, Come over here, pick up one of these laptops whoa, and whoa, just... Whoa, 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 Ron, no, 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 I... What, Ron, what, what, what was that? I, no, 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 oh, ah, what? Not a problem, yeah. What, what? What are you doing? Imagine if they were real laptops, Alan. They are real laptops, Ron, are you serious? I wouldn't use real laptops to prove a point, Alan. Ron, I literally just spent the last two days fixing those laptops. They're real. Exactly. Do you really feel like you've won this? Grow up, mate. Adam. Yeah? Are you alright, mate? Yep. Yeah, no, I'm fine. Have you been crying? No, no, I'm not crying. You certainly look like you're crying. No. no that is not okay, mate. We're going to talk about this. We're having a meeting. <laughs> what? All right, guys. Uh, we had a bit of an incident on the shop floor. Uh, Adam was crying. Adam, were you crying? Are you okay? No. I just feel so overworked at the moment. We're working so hard and so quick. Yeah, so I'm going to have to instigate a new rule. No crying at work. Well, Ron, do you really feel that's the best solution for this? Absolutely. Yuck. He was crying. I was, it was disgusting. Like, you should have heard it. I was on the shop floor. I was playing Street Fighter. And suddenly I'm hearing this. And I'm like, oh, God. Is that Adam? Is he crying? Oh, f oh God, I, I'm gonna... Is he stopped? No, he's still crying. I'm gonna have to deal with this. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so it was pretty disgusting. Uh, Ron, instead of creating a blanket rule where we're like not allowed to cry, why don't we try and foster a work environment where we don't feel we need to cry? Uh, how do you suggest we do that, Alan? Maybe by creating a safe work environment where we can talk about our feelings. I don't care about your feelings. Yo. Like, I don't wow. care. I don't want to hear about it. Don't bring that to work, yuck, just keep it away, lock it inside, or block it, or just whatever you need to do so that it's not part of the work kind of environment, okay? Okay, well, what are you going to do about it? I've, I've got a solution that I think will appease everyone. New rule. You can cry in the bathroom. Oh, wow. I think I need to use the bathroom. You need to use the bathroom. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be long. Okay. Do you want me to close the door? Guys, want to do some team building? Come out. Not Ryan, seriously, we are way too- Alan! Come out! Okay. 
And now, do you guys know how to play Simon Says? Yes. Oh, I love that game. Go, everyone, gather in. Come gather, gather on over here. <clears throat> okay. Simon Says, put your hands on your head. Okay. Let me try that again. Uh, Simon Says, put your hands on your head, Alan, or you're getting a pay cut. <laughs> There's the attitude. Nice. Okay. Simon Says, spin in a circle. Simon says, touch your nose. Touch your eyes. <laughs> oh, nice. Okay, okay. Simon says, laugh. <laughs> Simon says, shout. Hey! Simon says, wink. Give yourself a high five. Oh, oh <laughs> nearly. <laughs> okay, spin in a circle. Oh, oh no! Damn it! <laughs> I knew I'd get one of you. Okay, let's do this. Oh, now I've got you. Oh, I can sense some competition. Simon says, touch your toes. Simon says, jump. Simon says, give Rowan a thumbs up. Simon says, say Rowan is the best. Rowan is the best. Simon says, that feels really nice to hear. Simon says, he feels like he hasn't had a compliment in years. Um, Simon says, he feels like he really struggles to get people to respect him. <laughs> Simon says, he doesn't know if anyone actually really likes him. Simon says he doesn't think he's actually had a true friend in years. Simon says that he's worried about his mental stability. <clears throat> Simon says that uh, he He's worried about reaching out to his colleagues about how he feels because he's worried that he'll just end up pushing them away. <laughs> Simon uh, says that he feels really alone. Give Rowan a hug. Oh, of course, man. Yeah, man, dude. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Shame! I didn't say Simon says give Rowan a hug. And what were you even doing? You were out. <laughs> ah! Ha ha! Ah! Yes! I win! Ah! Ha ha! I don't like it when anyone gets close to me. Ah! I don't want to hurt. I don't want to feel the pain. Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha! Losers! Ah! We've got two of these. Cool. Ooh! This is going to cause a lot of drama. Wow! And that was one of the employees too. Caught on security camera. That's very incriminating. Like I say, this is going to cause a lot of drama. Oh god, I didn't see you guys there. What was that? What are Don't you- Don't engage, Adam. Oh, anyway guys, I've got a meeting. Um, I'm just going to leave this here. I'm going to come and collect this in a bit. But please don't open it, okay? Be right back, guys. So, are we going to talk about that? Honestly guys, I think we should just try and get through the week, okay? Did he say employee? That's what I heard. Do you think he means one of us? He definitely means one of us. Yeah, like who else would it be? What do you think's in it? Who cares? I don't know, but it sounded kind of bad. It's definitely bad. Do you think we should open it? Absolutely not. No. Oh, he clearly wants us to open it, but it makes me think we shouldn't open it. But maybe that's reverse psychology. Maybe it's a test. It's not a test, Adam. It's a trap. Yeah, he would do something f***ed up like that, so maybe we should open it. It could be money! It's not money, Adam. It's a trap. I've had a really bad week and this could turn it around. Okay, wow. we'll open it. I've got a good feeling about this. That's a pay cut for breaking confidentiality. I'm really disappointed in you. Was it money, Adam? Or was it a trap? Sorry, bro, that sucks. Right, thank you all for coming. Yeah, I mean, you said it was mandatory, As so. you know, sales have been down this quarter. Yeah, well, I think it's the economy, eh? So, I thought I would take it upon myself to devise an incentive program to increase sales. Oh, like, rewards for making sales? Yeah, something like that. Ta-da! Alright, run us through it. It's quite simple, really. The more sales you get in a day, the less you get punished. So, what? Punished? Yep. So, say uh, you get less than 10 sales in a day. That puts you here, tier one. This is not where you want to be, quite frankly. Tier one is the worst place you could be, and that will give you... 
a punch in the face. What? At 10 sales a day, that puts you in tier two. Congratulations, no punch in the face for you. Instead, you get a firm slap on the cheek. What, Ron? No, you can't. At 20 sales a day, that puts you in tier three. Congratulations, you get a slap on the wrist. Ron, these aren't incentives. These are just threats of physical abuse. No, 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 no. You didn't actually let me finish, Alan. Can I finish? Is it okay if I actually finish my presentation? Yeah. Because what I was going to say is that at tier four, you unlock just verbal abuse. Okay? Ron, this is insane. Can you shut the f*** up, Alan? You've got a weird-shaped head. What? That one's a freebie. Ron, this is crazy. Yeah, I was worried 50 sales might be too easy. Do you think I should up it to 100? No, I mean you can't beat us up just to make sales. What is wrong with this? I thought you guys would be excited about some motivation. See, look, look at Adam, he gets it. Guys, I'm almost at 10 sales. Adam. Tick tock, tick tock, it's almost closing. And maybe if you took the incentive seriously, like Adam, you'd make the upper tiers too. Because if not, it looks like you're gonna get a punch in the face. Uh... Okay, uh, Ron, this sounds Great, this all sounds well and good. Um, can I ask you a quick question? Sure, ask away. Um, how many sales do you have today? <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, I've been busy making uh, this. Oh, oh, so none then. None. Hmm. Well, <laughs> technically no. Yeah, right, okay. And what, um, oh, what tier would that put you in? Oh, and look at that, we've just closed. Yep, yeah. see Ron? This is absolutely ridiculous. Oh! Guys, I did it! I got 10 sales! Yes! Turn two, baby! Congratulations, buddy. <clears throat> How many sales did you guys get? Hey, Ellen, I was just wondering, did we have the... Dude, you don't have to be such a Rowan. I wasn't being a Rowan. You were being a Rowan. Uh, I was being a little bit of a Rowan. Mm-hmm. What's being a Rowan? You know when you're being a massive dick, when it's being a Rowan. Well, like, you wake up one morning and you're like, I'm gonna be an asshole today. It's being a Rowan. Ah, uh, so like, if I said, that's a new from me. Yeah, or, that's a pay cut for you, son. Or, well, when the thoughts are. When the thoughts are. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. were you? Yeah. Were you? <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh. Unbelievable. Uh, quiet place. Uh, actually, Un quiet place. Quiet place. Yeah. Oh, those quiet place. so economic peasants. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Well, actually, pay cuts oh, all around. There it is. Pay cuts there it is. all around. Oh. Pay cuts. Oh. So, pay cuts. So, so. Actually, well, uh, well, give it to work. Well. Give it to work. I've got uh, meetings. Oh, work, I've got meetings. Managers are privileges. Uh, boy. My name's Ryan. My name's Ryan, and I'm a model. And I'm a model. What's going on? Uh, we, we were, were you? Were you? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Quiet, please. But let's be honest. Low socioeconomic peasants, really, aren't you? So. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Looks like pay cuts all round. Uh-oh. And there it is. So. Yeah. Back to work. Some of us actually have meetings to attend. Yeah. Managers, privileges, bois. Oh. My name's Rowan. I'm a model. <laughs> so. Rowan. Yeah, we got that. So we've got, we've, uh, yeah, just check with us. Oh, morning, guys. <laughs> hey, Brian. Hi. Oh, that's another great revolution around the sun, isn't it? Hey. Hey, um, oh, what, uh, but, yeah. we have had a few orders. So what, is, what day is it today? Oh, uh, it's Wednesday. Wednesday, the... The, the 17th? 17th, Wednesday the 17th of... June. June. Um, I, I think those ones, ones there, they're, they're the ones that we need to get. Yeah, Is there so anything I've... special happening today? Not that I know. Don't, I don't, I don't. Do you want to check the calendar just to see if there's, the I'm pretty sure there's something in the calendar. No, there, nothing. There's no events in the calendar. Alan, do you want to check your have phone as well? The, yeah, have you got reminders got on your, so. Ellie, did you get a text? But anyway, so those, I do think we need Ron, to get Ron, I was just wondering if you could maybe check well, your phone. Oh, Brian, Brian, what, what, what do you want? Uh, you're being weak. You off. Okay. 
Sorry, we're just trying to do stuff here. So yeah, I think we need to order a couple more in because we- She's gonna put my lunch in the fridge. I don't care. Um. It's all good, it's all good. Don't worry, it's only... It takes a 24 hours long, so maybe, maybe they'll remember this evening. Has everyone practiced their speeches? They remember. They Just be cool. Be cool. We're cool. We're cool. Just we're cool. Keeping things cool. Keeping it real. Keeping it real. Just keeping it real. <laughs> oh, Byron! Can you come out here for a second, mate? Just keep it real. Keep it real. Real reactions. Real. Natural, natural, natural. Don't expect anything, okay? Real. for the Playtech birthday bonanza. Why would you think this is all for you? Oh, it was just that um, today... <laughs> Silly Brian always making <laughs> jokes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Brian. Yeah. Good Brian. Um, oh, all the decorations are for Playtech. Yeah, it's the Playtech birthday bonanza today. Yeah. And the um, customers, they, they get little goodie bags. Yeah, to be honest, Ryan, I'm surprised you splashed out on those. That's awesome. Yeah, well, there's some good stuff in there as well. I, I, honestly, for me, birthdays are actually really important. I think it's really important to celebrate them. Yeah, and you shouldn't forget them. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. never forget yeah. birthdays. Say what you will about Ryan, but he, he remembers a birthday. Yeah. Remembers a birthday. Remembers a birthday. Actually, that reminds me. Uh, I have actually got something for you. Oh, you got me something? Oh, uh, yeah, before I forget. Oh. Is this for me? Yeah, uh, that needs to be delivered across town as fast as you can, because it's probably going to take all day to get to Pukau mm -hmm. and back. Yeah, peak hour so, traffic. Yeah, 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 you better hightail that out of here. The, the address is on the form. Okay. Um. Bye bye. Bye bye. See you, mate. Yeah. I am so excited for this birthday bonanza. Oh, oh, so <laughs> hey, Adam. 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 Rowan, does the fact that I'm not replying to you saying Adam over and over again suggest that maybe, just maybe, you've confused our names? Adam, what are you talking about? You're being ridiculous. I'm sorry, I was down the road having lunch. I heard you calling my name. What's going on? No, I was yelling Adam's name. Because there's something I want to tell you, Adam. What is it? Oh my gosh, shut up, Alan. What? Shut up. Just... This okay, Ron, I'm going to say this to you in real simple English. Black and white. Okay. Just paint like a real obvious simple picture, okay? So you can wrap your head around it. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm Alan. This is Adam. Oh, okay. Okay. You've <laughs> confused our names. Mm. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to flip that right back around on you and say you're being ridiculous. No, no, he's telling the truth. That's Alan. I'm Adam. I think I know who my employees are, Alan. You clearly don't. This is absurd. Yes, this is absurd. I'm going to get back to work now. Okay, fine. But before you get back to work, Alan, there's still something I need to tell you. What is it? Can you stock the shelves? Can you stock the shelves out the back? Can you stock the shelves out the back in the warehouse with the thermal take fans? Rowan, that is literally what I was doing right now! Okay. Play a little game, mate. You play a little game. Ellie! Ellie, what are you doing back here? Get back in the teaspoon dropping cupboard. But I'm hungry. Get back in the teaspoon dropping cupboard right now. But I'm hungry. And you, have you, 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 uh, you, 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 Hey, man. Whoa. What's going on, bro? What do you mean? Well, what do you mean? Like, look at your watch. 
What, what does it say? What time is it? 9.01. Yeah, like, and what time do you start? Do you see the problem there? Like, you know what, what time do you, you start? 9, don't you? Yeah. So I'm not trying to be a dick or anything, but I am going to have to put in a disciplinary notice. Wow. Like, that is going to be a written warning. You, you know you don't have to, to do that. I, like, I, I'm not trying to be a dick or anything, but we, we can't operate like this. We, we simply can't operate like this. So you're not trying to be a dick I'm not trying to be a dick or anything, but we, we just, we can't, we can't operate like this. Yeah. Yeah. Like, like, what's the time now? Like, even just talking about this, what's the time on your watch now? It's 9.02 now. So how, how, much time have we, how much time have we just wasted doing this? Like, it's, a, it's got a kind of a, a spiral on effect. Okay. Yeah. I'm real sorry, bro, but if you can just get on with stocking the, I think the Corsair needs stocking. That's all good. <laughs> Ron, I, I need to tell you something. What is it? I um I undercharged a customer by forty dollars before because he gave me some weird change and it really confused me about what I need to give him. Okay, well thank you for telling me. It was a mistake though, I swear. But you know what I have to do now. Please, no. Turn around, please. Turn around, please. Do I have to? Adam! Shame! 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 Ellen, grab the cloak. Ah, uh, do I have to? Grab the cloak! <sighs> you <sighs> You dirty Shame. little f you! You are a worthless piece of ah! Oh, I hate you! Everybody hates you! Shame. You, you dirty peasant! You shame. Feel the shame. Feel the shame. You f***ed up. You f***ed up. You shame. are a f worthless piece of shame. 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 Right, are we done? Yeah. Okay, Adam, Adam, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna try a thing, okay? Okay. So close your eyes. Okay. Close your eyes. Okay, now put it in your hand. Here. Here. Okay, try and guess if this is a Moro bar or a Mars bar. Wait, do Mars or Moro have peanuts in them? I mean they don't have peanuts in them. What a stupid question. I just want to check just because I'm deathly allergic to peanuts. Yeah, okay, yeah. Mars and Moro don't have peanuts in them. Okay, so just try and guess. Mars bar or Moro bar? Hmm. They're quite crunchy. Oh, so Mars or Moro? You know, it... It actually doesn't taste like either of them. Ah, oh, do right. you know why? Do you know why? Why? Because it's a Snickers! Psych! <laughs> could you guess Snickers? I was, I was going to see if you could guess Mars or Mars, so I put Snickers in there as like a kind of a, kind of a wild card. Is, is it really a Snickers? Yeah, it's a Snickers. A Snickers. I was just trying to trick you. Ron, I'm allergic to Snickers. Uh, that's not a thing. Ron, can I, can I go home early today? Uh, okay, Adam, joke's over. I was just trying to see if he could guess it, now he's just being a dick. I think I, I think I need to go to the hospital. You, no, you can't. No, you don't need to go to the hospital. The, okay, the joke's over now. The joke's over. What, what, what are you doing? Who are you calling? I'm calling an ambulance. Don't, don't, don't call an ambulance. Okay, the joke. Okay, joke's over. You're being stupid now. No one is allergic to peanuts. It's not a thing. Look. 
Ellen! Yeah. Right, come here. <laughs> Adam's saying that, get this, he's allergic to peanuts. He is. Adam, have you eaten some peanuts? Holy shit, are you okay? Who gave him peanuts? Right, why would you do that? Yeah, I gave him a- oh, oh, I'm sorry, I gave him a Snickers bar. Ron, one of the primary ingredients in Snickers are peanuts. Yes, because it's a Snickers bar. Yes. <laughs> Ron, you could have literally killed him. You're being stupid. Listen to me very carefully. No, no one is allergic to peanuts. Are you serious? So many people, Ron, are allergic to peanuts. Oh. Ron, this is literally a life and death situation. We have to do something about this. Rowan, don't you dare. No, I just say, I've got a thing. I was like, oh no, no Rowan, this is not a time no, for no, no, this. No, 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 I just said, I thought I thought I had a thing. I was like, was I there? No, I thought I was there. No, you're sure. I was just like, Rowan, do not walk away from this situation. No, Tyler, because I was just said, I thought we said. You are liable for manslaughter if you walk away from this, Rowan. Yeah, yeah. Because I was just saying, I was like, yeah. Rowan, do, do not walk away. He's gone. He's gone. He, he just left. Uh. Okay, well, I, I, I am going to call, I'm going to call an ambulance, because that's what I need to do. Oh. Hey Ron, I need to talk to you about something. It's for you. Uh, what is it? It's my resignation letter. I'm leaving. Oh, uh... Yeah, I'm sorry. Oh, wow, I'm sorry. I'm sorry too, I... I didn't ever think this day would come, uh, but... that's a no. On that. But this is my resignation letter. Y you know, no, I fully understand what it is, it's just that's a no, unfortunately, because it's just a bad time for Playtech to be losing any staff, so that's a no on that. I didn't think that's how it worked, I thought I gave you the... No, it's just that, uh, from, a, from, a, okay, from an official play, Playtech standpoint, just to be absolutely clear, that's a, that's a no. But I need to leave, because you know how my dad died a few weeks ago, well, now my mom's looking after the farm by herself, and with her dicky back she can't do as much lifting anymore, so she's no good around the farm. Oh. So she's asked me to come down and look after it with her, and it's five hours away so I couldn't commute to work. Oh, shit. So that's why I need to leave. I'm sorry. Right. Okay. Okay, no, no, I hear what you're saying. Everything. Thanks, Ron. Okay. Uh, so that... That is a no. On that. One, two... Uh, four, four... Five... So I wonder if I get six. Six. I'll try seven. Yeah. No, I can't do it. I can't do it. Uh, take that there. Make sure I can see the other bit here. These bits. These little bits here. Put them in there. Make sure you don't drop them, just chuck them in the bin. Uh, are you all good to cover Alan's shift on Saturday? Yep. Hey Rowan, look at my TikTok! Adam's just showing me a TikTok and I f***ing hate it, what do I do? You can try and give him a compliment sandwich. What's a compliment sandwich? So you give him a compliment, and then you give him some constructive feedback, and then you end it with another compliment. So positive, negative, positive. Yep, you got it. Adam, in regards to your TikTok, I really like your watch. Oh, thanks, Ron. That TikTok was the worst thing that I've ever seen. You're a terrible dancer. I can't believe that a 30-something-year-old man is actually on TikTok dancing like the little girls that dance on TikTok. You're an embarrassment. You're a terrible person. I f***ing hate you. I f***ing hated that. That was so f***ing embarrassing that I'm cringing right now. You're a cringy person. That was so terrible. I hate you. You're an inferior being. Everything about you is pathetic. You're a pathetic person. Watching you do that actually made me want to vomit. F you. You have really nice shoes. 
Thanks for the constructive feedback, Rowan. I'm gonna go make more TikToks! Yes! That was effective. It's not bad. You get to see this video. Come on, just, just press the button. Hey, bye. <laughs> Can you come out for a sec? Yeah! <laughs>